Morning. It's Monday the 13th of May, 2024. Sorry for the unkempt look, but uh, been at a festival all weekend. Beautiful festival with beautiful people. Uh, so, I've loads of comments to catch up on uh, from previous videos. I've seen comments coming through, but I'm in an area with this bad signal, so I don't know what time this is going to go on, but I will catch up with comments later. Uh, only little bit of news I've seen this weekend is uh, Gary Lineker is uh, been shooting his mouth off again, as the Davers believe. And uh, he spoke out about what's happening, the genocide, what's happening in Israel, in Gaza. And uh, for that cuckoo, listen, is that in my head? The cuckoo, yeah. Uh, I forgot what I'm saying there. So, yeah. Uh, same as when he spoke out against Suella Braverman and her uh, inflammatory language, linked it with like Nazism and got slaughtered and they were all wanting to get, take him off television for that, etc, etc. And like I say, he spoke out, just watch this clip if you've not seen it, it's very interesting. Um, I've seen so many images of, of children that, you know, I've got no skin in this game. I, you know, I'm not, I'm not Muslim, I'm, I, I'm, you know, not Jewish. I'm not Israeli, I'm not Palestinian. So I see it, I think, purely from the outside as from a neutral perspective. And I, I, I can't think of anything that I've seen worse in my lifetime. The constant images of children losing their lives day in, day out. Now, obviously, we, we all know what, you know, October 7th happened and, you know, the mass thing. But the minute you, you know, you, you, you raise your voice against what they're now doing there, um, you know, you get accused of being a supporter of Hamas or, you know, all this kind of stuff. So there is, you know, there's a lot of heavy lobbying on people to be quiet. So I understand why most people um, refrain. But I'm getting on a bit now. Um, I, you know, it's, I'm, I'm fairly secure um, and I can't be silent about what's happening there. I think it's just, it's so, so utterly awful. And now they're talking about, you know, it already looks like it's happening, going into Rafa, where they've sent everybody down there. So, you know, I, I don't think you can be, you know, it's not anti-Semitic to say that what Israel is doing is wrong. Um, and I, 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 just, I just can't see how everybody doesn't see it that way now. For, you know, whatever, whatever the cause, whatever started it, and we all know that, you know, the history of the, the, this area of the world goes way before October the 7th. But it's it's truly dreadful what's happening. And I, I, I cry on a regular basis when I see certain images on, on social media. There you go. Well said, Gary. That was straight from the heart. Emotional, so we say. Speaking the truth. We need more people like Gary Lineker. He's the only one out there. Well, one of the very few who's prepared to put his head above para parapet and get, uh, get it shot down. So, where do we go from here? I don't know. The establishment are going to go after Gani. I think he said he's uh, reasonably sound, which meant they can't bust him for money, which is what they'd like to do. Uh, so yeah, I'm on Gary's side, Team Lineker. Oh, Gary, 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 Lineker. Oh, Gary, 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 Lineker. Have a great day, everybody.